Hello everyone, welcome back. This is 1940, turn four for the Anzacs. Uh, real quick, quick admin note. Kind of forgot, we didn't do the convoy raid against Italy in zone 99. So we'll do that real quick. We'll see what, see what happens. Okay, so the Italy did lose two IPC off of that. So they lost two IPC. All right, going over to the Anzac team. They're going to buy a tank for 6, a fighter for 10, and a destroyer for 8. Um, yeah, we'll do the Anzacs and then we'll do the French. Anzacs. All right, the big one. They are mustering their entire fleet to attack the Japanese fleet off of Dutch New Guinea to precipitate a landing of Anzac forces on Dutch New Guinea. We got to got to try and get that um national objective back for us. So that is the Anzacs only attack. So let me uh, set up our little piecemeal battle board right here. Two, two, three, two, two. Really gambling here on this one, and we're bringing in, and we're bringing in two fighters. And the Japanese have a battleship for four, destroyer for two, cruiser for three. All right, let's hope for the best for this one for the Anzacs. Oops. All right, so the Anzacs have four destroyers for two. Two hits. So the Japanese will at least take the first hit on the battleship. And then hit on the destroyer. And then we got a cruiser and two fighters for three. All right, we got it. Killed the cruiser and we killed the Japanese battleship. So they have been moved into the casualties. All right, so Japan. Now we'll fire back with the destroyer. Ooh, that's a hit. The cruiser. Ooh. And the battleship. Oh, and the battleship missed. All right, so that is the Japanese Navy off of Dutch New Guinea being destroyed. Uh, make our little graveyard right here. So then, like I said, we will... It moves up, and this transport is lost. So the Anzac, Anzacs came out with two destroyers and a cruiser surviving. And their two fighters, which I'll just non-combat back right now. So they, the one from Java went one, two. We'll bring him back to Java. That'll give him a movement of four. The one from the Northern Territory, one, two. And we'll just land him. Oh, one, two. Yeah, he'll just go back to the Northern Territory as well. All right, so now we have the ground battle. We have two Anzac infantry for one, an Anzac infantry and an artillery for two against the Japanese infantry and artillery for two. Whoops. All right. Let's see how this goes. All right. So the two Anzac infantry for one. No hits. Infantry artillery for two. Miss. All right. The Japanese infantry artillery for two. They got one. All right, we'll, we'll press the attack. All right, one Anzac for one. Oh, they got a hit. And then the infantry artillery for two. Oh, miss. Then the infantry artillery for Japan. It's another hit. Shoot. Okay, well, we'll at least try one more time. Let's press the attack. All right, two for two. Okay, we got it. And then he rolls one for two. Koof! Japan getting lucky with all these hits today. However, it is not enough. And the du and Dutch New Guinea goes back to goes to goes to the Anzacs. I'll get a Anzac marker here. So they recaptured Dutch New Guinea. Which also means that 
so it's oops, sorry for the glare guys so um dutch new guinea new guinea new britain and the solomon islands which is correct so the anzacs have gotten back their other their other um national objective and so that is it for the Anzac turn. So we will do some non-combats real quick. So we already moved the fighters back. Oh, these two destroyers are, or these two transports are in this season as well. Excuse me. Whoops, sorry. And that season as well. Okay, now oh, let's get the dice right out of here. All right. So non-combats. Okay, so we have. I suppose we really only have one, um, which is, well, we have the infantry here going to Queensland, and then we'll take this fighter from Malaya, and we'll bring it up and join the Allied Air Force in, up, up there in Burma, and we'll reinforce the British there. All right, so deployments. All the Anzac forces are deploying here in Sydney. I'll clear out the arrows. All right. So let's see here. At the end of the turn. All right. So that is the end of the Anzac turn. Let's see here. They will collect... 14 and 10, and they saved one, so they will have 25 to spend on the next turn. All right, and then going over to the French. Obviously, the French can't buy anything. They are going to try one round of combat here in Algeria, at least do one round of combat here in Algeria against the Italians. So... We have four French infantry against three Italian units. All right, so the four French infantry for one. Ooh, no hits. And the three Italian defenders for two. Nothing. All right, let's try again. Okay, there's one hit. They also got a hit. All right, so that's a one for one. Let's see here. All right, that puts the French at three infantry. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna go again. I want to see to see what happens with this one. We traded one for one last time. Maybe we'll get. Maybe we'll get lucky. Okay, so we now have three for one. Hmm, nothing. And two for two. Okay, yep. That was a hit. So we'll call... So we'll stop the attack now. It was a nice... Yeah, I mean, it was a gamble. that we. Won't, it was a gamble I wanted to try. Alright, so now on to non-combats for the French. They're going to bring this infantry up into Egypt. They're going to bring their infantry down to Jordan. Oh, whoops. I meant to move this Anzac infantry in with the Brits in Egypt as well. So the Brits have a sizable, a sizable army there in Egypt against the Italians now. Um... The French destroyer will move, well, yeah, we'll move the French destroyer at least to link up with the um, British battle, the British cruiser, just to give it some, you know, just to have some added protection there. Um, and that's it. And France doesn't collect any income and doesn't have any deployments. All right, so that is the end of the Anzacs and the French and also brings about the end of turn four. So 1941 has been, 1941 is complete. And now we'll move over to turn five for January 1942. So until then, guys, we'll see you next time.